Don't Panic. Yeah. I like that sure. record because you, you talked about, you know, drug abuse on there. Towards so. the end, you talked about drug abuse. Um, and I, I, wanna, I wrote down a lyric, so I want to read it to you. You said, um, I don't feel pain, drug user. I'm feeling like Whitney, uh, purple cup, fuck my kidney. But what a hell of a feeling. So it's like you understand what the shit do to you. For sure. But it's like it, it puts you in a comfort, in a comfortable zone that you're okay with. Why, sure. why, why is that? Man. Ask me again. Why, why are you comfortable with being in that, in that zone? Like, does it just help you escape reality? Like, are you, are you dealing with things that you just got to nah, be gone from? Like, what, what's, what's, what's so important about it that makes, you, that makes you feel, to quote you, give you hell of a feeling? No, it just, it, you know, make me chill. Make you sit back and chill. Yeah. Make time pass faster type shit. What would you describe, um, like, how would you describe how would you describe how often you deal with, you know, <laughs> we want to say it, the cup, whatever you want to say, like, how, how would you describe it? Man, I is it is it to I, a point I just where smoke weed, man. You don't do, you don't I do the sip, cup? I sip every night, then. Don't tell me you be lying in your music. This shit just out of my nah <laughs> hell nah. I'm saying I sip every now and then, but yeah, this shit, yeah. this shit I smoke, I smoke. Is it like a creative thing? Like yeah, 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 yeah type yeah. shit. Yeah. Can you focus without it? Do you think yeah. so? Okay. For sure. Yeah. Okay. So back to the uh, the no cap the the no cap record. The reason why I want to go back to that because you were on tour with Cap in 2020. Yeah. Um, and I, I was watching a documentary. You said something really important on that doc. And I want you. I want to expound on it more. You said performing in front of a lot of people, and or just that crowd, and nobody know you. Yeah. But that was honest, and I love the fact that you What's were up? that honest because it was like that's that's the real. Like when you're a new artist coming up, you're not gonna be performing in front of people that know you. Yeah, yeah. But what did you learn in that moment? You like, gotta make them know you, type shit, and like just try to stand out from mm -hmm. everybody. How do you feel like you've been able to do that over the from from then to now? How you feel like you've been able to do that to get people to hear you? With my style, like the way I come, I feel like I come different than everybody else. Mm -hmm. So, what is that like? What's different? She, Remember, I was telling you about my ex girlfriend. Yeah, that's how she I be asking that me questions. I put the flavor on my seat. I put the flavor on my seat. Mm -hmm. Everybody else be, you know, they put my own flavor on mine. Yeah. Yeah, so I feel like I'm different than everybody else. Like you be talking about personal. You, yeah, you, I come from my from my perspective. They mm -hmm. can't come from my perspective because they ain't they ain't me. Yeah, okay. yeah. So I'm different. And you rap, and to to add to that too, you rap from a perspective of like things you observe yeah. throughout uh, uh, Clark Street. Like For you sure. literally rap like that. So when you when I'm listening to the project, I could vision myself there you know what I mean? even though i'm not from there i'm sure. like oh shit i see myself there you know 